I can do this right now with us. May I try to reassemble them, but it is not, not possible. Or it is quite difficult right now looking. Now, once it's open, you carefully play it like this way. So, because when like, you will know, pull the weight pressure, it applies a little bit. Okay, so it will not come the teeth out. So, there's a little bit clip. They will clip it. So, they are clip, unclip by the way. Yes, give it quite pretty to open a part. It's come out like. Yes, give it quite pretty to open a part. It's come out like that. These are switch panels, are the switches, and inside look like that. Basically, this is a T pad. So there is a paper, a flexible paper inside, flexible paper inside there, which contain two layers of flexible paper, and these are placed in the top and bottom side, and the top side and bottom side there are top of the, the top of the dots or top of the pad. So you can see there is a top of pad behind this. So which the pads when push these points, we then join, join these two layers of top of the pads. In order to complete a part which knows this processor, this top IC in this room, this is the top IC. So this IC is very tiny IC. So there, why use this IC? This IC is is a cost effective, low cost, small size, and it is also waterproof, noise proof, magnetic proof. This IC is, and this IC is also reverse engineering proof so you cannot reverse engineering it how it works because this is a mystery I see no serial number no serial pin so when you push this two layer of pad it made a part because top layer and bottom layer it is after coating with enamel paint instead these topper pads are a little bit bare when you push this topper pad it will join to that the Joined together, which made up electrical part. We know this IC and IC give data and clock signal with this white and red, white and red wire. And IC needs 5 volt or ground, which is provided by blue and green and black wire. So green and black is ground, blue is positive for this IC. And this IC contains three LEDs, three capacitors, two there's two is SMD and one is THT and three SMD LEDs and there's a mystery IC and this is a two, two layer of PCB flexible PCB and there's one more layer inside which is as, as a separator so it will not short to the other this is a three layer PCB. So this is a top layer, bottom layer and this is a separator. And this only these pads are conductive pads. When you push this, it made a path between top layer and bottom layer which order to make a complete circuit which does this IC. This IC in and there is multiple pads and multiple these pads in is not a it's not a multiplexing system so it acts like a multiplexer multiplexing configuration so when we push one by one key it's gen, it's normally turn on and turn on and off we apply some on and off input which then works zero one binary digit which those this data wire in order where this PS2 connecting to computer and the computer knows which T is best.